Welcome back, everyone. Jerry's here with some more ACU, and we're going to continue on with the story. We tried out uh, two side missions. If you haven't seen them, uh, be sure to check out previous episodes. I believe I did two side missions. It was a detective story, and there was another one, uh, one of these assassin missions. That uh, And I'm going to leave these for a little later. Right now, we're just going to progress through the story, see if we can learn more stuff, some learn some more moves and you know just learn how to play and make our experience a little bit easier because this game is brutal if you do not access the things that they that they're implementing in the game so it's pretty brutal to someone that does not uh, use the controls and gets used to them quickly you just get beat down and you just don't you won't know why <laughs> but it's all part of the experience it's a lot of fun to learn stuff so let's see if I can uh advance the story and learn something else actually I saw a chest right over here why this guy run did you pickpocket someone and getting chased what's going on why did people just oh, that guy was getting choked why do these people just run out of nowhere it's out of blue um, let's get upstairs get in there where is the uh, the chest? I guess it's more upstairs. Or could it also be a safe too? That would be cool, man. But I'm pretty sure we'd need a pickpocket ability. And I, I wonder when will we learn the pickpocket ability? I guess we're going to have to... I, I don't even know. How do you even level up? I guess we're going to have to do missions. How we got the, the hammer last episode. Because we would have to do missions to get the uh, other stuff. 400 bucks. That's... Whoa! Okay, <laughs> that's a lot of cash, man. What is in this blue area that is so important? Oh, this is where I got the heads from last time, I believe. Let's just get out of my way. We're going to go around. And if you've been watching episodes, you'll know what that red chest is all about, man. I want to pet an animal. Like, why can't I pet anything? It's... All right, well, let's keep going. Hopefully, the more we play, maybe maybe I have to learn. Maybe I have to level up an ability on how to pet animals or something. But, uh, um, let's go through here. Okay. So, our next mission, we might be meeting the assassins. Rewards. High difficult mission, buy skills, weapons, and equipment to increase your level. Okay. So... Buy skills, weapons, or equipment. Buy skills. What do you mean by buy skills? Customize his loadouts. I guess we can customize the loadout. Downloadable content. Unlocked content. Two items available. All right, Razor Spearhead. Hey. Um. Yeah. Character customization. Redeem codes. We'll do. The character customization and all that once we unlock that costume. Helix credits. What the hell was a helix credit initiates? You play. I have some stuff on you play from uh, previous games that I probably could use. Database uh, tutorials. Hey, the tutorials are here. Yeah. Case files. We've already looked through this person and we solved it already. And encyclopedia, we've met a bunch of people as well. Um, view boosts. What? What am I? How do I love buy skills, weapons, or equipment to increase my stuff? I guess we have to look into. Uh, I guess we sort of have to customize our character. Where is my uh, my customized screen? I feel like I've lost it. I thought all was here is options. No, it's not. You play eStore progress database. Huh? It's got to be in the store here. Unlock all unlock all points of interest in Paris now. I don't want to unlock everything by just buying. Hackable features. Oh, no get out get out of the PlayStation store get out of there. I, I'm not buying anything right now well 
whatever. I guess we're just gonna have to do this mission, and uh, they didn't even show me how to level up or anything. Buy skills, weapons, or equipment. Is there anything even in town I can buy this stuff from? Let's... This guy is just a regular shop. Um, we'll try this regular shop then. That's just weird. Once again, we're we are failing to teach teach uh, what to do to prepare for these things. Let's see if they sell anything. They sell any weapons? Consumable shop. Let's go to the shop. Cherry bombs. I already have all this stuff. Where do I get the weapons from? Um, where is there a weapon shop on the map? Is there even a weapon shop here? Shop. I'm, I'm looking just to see if there's something that says weapon shop. Anything different. Underground entrance shop. I guess I have to do these or something. I don't know. Maybe I should do these little missions and uh, before I can continue the main story or... Let me see how many of these are left on the map. One, two, three, four. It's kind of weird that the mission did say four. No, there's five. There's a fifth one over here as well. Hmm. How are we going to go about this? High difficulty mission. Rewards. I don't even know what we get. We're just going to do it. And hopefully the game shows me how to purchase stuff. Do I really have to go to the tutorials to learn everything? Myself? They don't uh, implement it in the game? You kill two birds with one stone that way. You know, if you implement it in the game and show us how to do stuff. Um, Alright. So let's climb up. Nice weapon. Oh yeah, the stealth. I forgot about that stealth thing. Investigate. If you can pluck your head from your own arse, come find us. How'd you know to turn it? Oh, we're gonna have to do some climbing in here, my friends. We're gonna have to do some climbing and get our ways all the way upstairs, I guess. Okay, okay, I see, I see. Um... Come to the center here. Now let me see. There's nothing else that's gold in the room that I'm aware of. We should just jump on this to be safe. And I'm supposed to trust diving into that? <laughs> Fine, I'll do it. I don't care. We'll jump into that hole, boy. I mean, Arno isn't an assassin yet. How does he know to just jump into that safely? The whole thing with the coin, how do you know to turn the coin? I would have just plugged it in. I wouldn't even known to plug it in. I would have just looked at it and said, what is this weird thing? A lot of uh, untold stories here that we somehow know how to do already. I guess because my dad was an assassin, it's in the blood. Took you long enough, piss pot. <laughs> what is this place? The sanctuary, a place we can train and prepare away from the eyes of our enemies. 
Didn't we just escape from a dungeon? It's not a dungeon. It's a nerve center. From these tunnels, we can get anywhere in the city, all without being seen. We have eyes everywhere. Really? Seems visibility would be a problem. Wouldn't you prefer something with a view? This place is served I miss my well auto for 600 walk. years, Pisspot. Mm hmm. And how long were you standing in the dark waiting for me? Not long. Guillaume spotted you from the bell tower. Well, it was quite the entrance. Are you mocking me? No, no. God's truth, very theatrical. Shut up. We're here. <laughs> Shut up. The will approach. So... So, the son of Charles Dorian returns to us. Belek thought you wouldn't come, but changed your mind. I'm tired of running from my failures. Monsieur de la Serre, my father. I want to make it right. The death of Grandmaster de la Serre weighs on you. Why? Did you wield the blade yourself? Does it matter? The blame still lies with me. Inna the Nubahu took Kilo Kailai. Hal Anta Muta Akidon Min? Anna Catholic. Inna Ukadnerala Muajati El Muakama. Say Kunu Jaidan. Very well. Out of the dark you come into the light. From the light you will return to the dark. Are you prepared to travel the Eagle's path? If that's a fancy way of asking, do I want your help? Yes. Then drink. Okay. So let's get wasted. Oh, the frames are dying. Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. I'm going down here. Oh, this is where I was taking a drink. Oh, What's God. A lit up room. Is this the best idea? I feel like I have to jump down. Yep. Are we back at home? Can't I go with you, Father? Courage, my boy. You wait just here. I will return when this hand reaches the top, and there is to be no mischief. Damn, kids. Father! Where is that boy? I'm certain I told him six o'clock. We should be well away by now. Father, it's me! I'm here! So we want to hurry up. Does the exit get further away? Oh. Skulls everywhere? Oh my god, we restarted the hallway. Yeah! 
you can die in here. Holy crap. Okay. <laughs> I was just like, oh, yeah, I'll just slide. That looks cool. I don't know. I didn't even know you could die in here. Holy crap. So we might want to slow down on the sliding and not hold the button. Father, where is that boy? Oh, we're doing all this again? Holy crap. Okay. We should be well away. Slide normal. If you slide too fast, you'll die. Okay. okay. <gasps> Who is that guy? Yo, he beat the hell out of my dad. Who are you? for loser. This is usually the stuff Desmond experienced. But who is the assassin right now? Who is the person that's, you seem to have caused quite that's a uh, in the animus for this? You were worse. Oh god, if I would have fallen off right there, I'd be pretty sad. Go, I'll distract them. So we're gonna go that way. Truly. Oh my god, they keep showing me my dad getting destroyed in every angle. Uh, okay. So we're walking up to the lights. Stand in a circle, something cool happens. Oh my way, let me see that picture. What's going on? Oh! You can die in here too, you get shanked, holy crap. I don't even know what my mission is in there. I'm just walking around. Alright, I guess the mission kill the assassin without being detected. Gotcha.
These are the words spoken by our ancestors. The words that lay at the heart of our creed. Stay your blade from the flesh of the innocent. Hide in plain sight. Never compromise the Brotherhood. Let these tenets be branded upon your mind. Follow them and be uplifted. Break them at your peril. Rise, assassin. We must now cut off your finger. Arnold Dorian is dead. He has been culled from this world. His sins and failures turned to dust. Tonight he is reborn, a novice of the Assassin Brotherhood. Okay. I learned how to do that real fast. Rate this memory. This was pretty cool. Rebirth. You've earned the trophy. So, do I get my cool outfit now? You guys gonna dress me up? Gonna have some Barbie's Playhouse right now? These loading screens are crazy. They're absolutely ridiculous. I feel like I'm playing Skyrim on console. Two hours. In the 1950s, it was theorized that human DNA worked via the triple helix model. Some years later, the work of Crick and Watson demolished this theory in favor of the double helix. Today, we know the double helix to be indisputably the basis of all life. So why did the triple helix theory gain so much traction? Why did Rosalind Franklin's x-rays seem to confirm it? It turns out that their initial samples had been taken from small traces of precursor DNA, the rare genes of an ancient race embedded in our own. We now know that triple helix DNA is the foundation of the precursor genome. It is the genetic Rosetta Stone of our age. If we can crack it open, if we can sequence the full precursor genome, there is no limit to the knowledge we will gain. Using Animus technology, precursor history will be open to us for the first time ever. Ancient languages will be unlocked, and ancient technology will be ours for the taking. Imagine what will be possible if we master the technology that underpins the pieces of Eden. Such discoveries would surpass 100-fold the splitting of the atom. Last year, we located a rich sample of precursor DNA in a donor whose genes contained human and precursor DNA at an incredible 25 to 1 ratio. Our work will begin with this sample. Our goal is to unravel the triple helix, sequence the precursor genome, and change the world for the better, forever. Welcome to the Phoenix Project. Okay. 
Interesting. So we are now officially part of the Phoenix Project. We're an assassin initiate. So, this is where we stand. Last year, a stairgirl acquired the body of a man we call a sage, one of a Ooh. rare breed of humans with a surplus of ancient DNA. This sparked a search for more sages, in the present and in the past. The more Abstergo finds, the closer they get to their final goal. We've blocked their recent attempts to find more, but Abstergo will not stop looking until they sequence a full precursor genome. So, why Arno Dorian? Why chase an assassin through the French Revolution? It turns out, at some point in his life, Arnaud came into contact with another sage. We need you to find out when and where these meetings took place. If Arnaud was present for this sage's death, it might lead Abstergo straight to his body. Naturally, we'd like to find it first. This is where you come in. It won't be simple. Genetic memory must be tackled in sequence to keep the data stable. But we're confident you're up to the task. And you won't be alone. Other initiates, assassins just like you, are doing their part to end this fight. If you need more training, more experience, you can call on them for help. All right. Loading the next sequence. Okay, so we just completed sequence one, I'm assuming. Oh no. Oh, we got our new clothes, guys. I've got something else for you. The more time you spend with Arno, the more data we'll have to increase your synchronization with him and to activate his abilities. Here, have a look at this. Okay, so new assassin ability have been unlocked in your skills menu. Range weapon, assassin cachet, money pouch, stun grenade, disguise, apprentice locksmith. Simmering strike, uh, blending, double assassination. Okay. So we have melee attack. Okay, we'll have to look at the tutorials. One handed weapon master. Staggering strike, which I could buy right now. Okay, gotcha. Admiral Strike looks like it could be good, an unbalancing attack that stuns the enemy for a moment. That's like the only thing we can purchase. We could... Actually, we could purchase these. I have enough, I think, or do I not? Well, I have enough, but I just don't have the weapon at all. We have to complete certain sequences. Wow, we won't see a new ability till sequence 5. So let's purchase this one for now. Staggering Strike, that should help me in fights. So I have to hold down X to perform, to perform a little stun. Um, I don't know how that's gonna help me against a crowd of enemies, cause holding down X, it looks like it's a little, it takes a little while to charge up and hit them. Uh, ranged. So hold L1 to aim and press R2 to shoot. That's weird for me. I prefer uh, L2 to aim, but that's fine. Um, can't afford this cache to create an assassin cache which allows you and allies to recover bombs and other consumables man i need to save up for that um what do we have here i have two points left it can be thrown to attract crowds when equipped yeah but is this attracting crowds is nice but even during a riot the guards don't even care they're still like uh looking at their post real good it can stun groups of enemies when equipped this sounds really good because it stuns them. It's better than the smoke bomb. They're, they're like, oh, where'd he go? But a flash uh, stun grenade sounds really good. I might get that as my second ability. Uh, stealth. Ability to share eagle vision with allied players. I'm probably going to play this uh, solo for the most part. I can disguise myself and nearby as a selected target. Alright, so you press down. Interesting. The ability to pick the lock on doors and chests. I want to know what's inside those chests. I might actually get this. Now, what do we have over here? It's the uh, fatal aerial attack against two nearby targets. Okay, so we have to unlock the skills. You don't just get them. 
It'll strike against two nearby targets. Um, to vanish. Okay. The ability to vanish before performing one day activity, such as. What do you mean to vanish? You make it environmental blending. Is my blending gonna work better now? So you telling me the blending I had before was garbage? Is that what you're telling me? Maybe I could use this. Yeah, I guess that could be good. Stealth could be good. Um, I was thinking about getting the... Uh, I mean, the, the stun sounds really good. but uh, This sounds good too, but this this is not a the stealth is oh man i backed out too much the uh it's not gonna help me that much when i'm doing other stuff initiates how do i get back in there ah, i see view skills menu got it all right, stealth. It's it's good, but when I'm doing an actual mission where people are just fighting me and attacking me everywhere, I'm saying a little more damage in combat. I might get this thicker skin because I'm really bad at the combat right now. Let me see. Withstand more damage. Man, he is just eating attacks right there. What the hell? Much more damage. Wow. It's two points though. I mean, more damage is nice, but uh, the ability to heal nearby players, I'm going to be playing a lot of solo. So it's either the heal or the, the grenade here, the stun grenade. Can I instantly assassinate them while they're stunned is the question. And then there's also the, uh, the stealth one over here, which I got my eye on, but I don't think I need it right now. So, you know what? Let's go with the stun grenade in case things do go bad. Um, if things do go bad, I think the stun grenade would help me more instead of the taking more damage. Because more damage, I mean, I'm going to get hit more, but with the stun grenade, they'll be stunned. And uh, I'll be able to beat them down a little bit. Maybe, uh, hopefully more. I don't know. It depends how many stun grenades I get. So, we got all those skills. Seems he was a busy guy. See that symbol? That's a co-op mission. I play a lot of games multiplayer. I don't know about you, but I thought you'd like to mix it up a little. These are missions are no ram with his assassin buddies. So they'll give you an idea of what our organization's about. Just walk into the glitch and you'll get all the details. I've marked them on your map. Okay. Uh, weapons. Aha! Uh -huh. Now we got weapons. We'll mess with this next episode. We'll mess with all that next episode. How do I equip my... Uh, my... My weapon new weapon how do i do it i don't even have to hold l2 it's just pressing it is good enough good to learn good to know good to know um maybe my weapon is just automatically used all the time when i stealth kill someone Looks like my eagle vision is a bit longer. At least it seemed that way. I'm not really sure if that's really the case. Ledge assassination, that's good to have. Cloud uh, blend. Maybe when I learn that technique, I'll actually blend with the crowd for real. Well, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Thanks for checking it out. And uh, hopefully I catch you guys on the next one. And until then, friends, see ya. What a weird angle.